What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back and uh, we are going to be taking on the next boss, the summoned leader Tidium or Tidium. Tidium sounds better, but you never know how to never know how to pronounce some of these names. It could go either way. But yeah, we got the next I almost fought this boss without recording by accident. I was just playing with friends and I was like, yeah, I was just going through doing some uh you can get a first look at the boss interesting that's a real interesting boss it's a dude on the back of a frog with its face covered very interesting but uh i was going through with some friends and i just was like oh i'm gonna do my quest whatever i wasn't even thinking but luckily the leader is the only one that can use the scroll and i was not the leader of the party so that was a positive thing to happen, but here we go. Time to kick it off. I'm actually going to pop one of these milk teas. And let's get going. I leveled up a little bit since the last episode, but I don't believe I did anything anything else. I didn't like get new armor or anything crazy like that. This camera angle is less than to be desired. Alright, let's hope for a harder boss fight. Not sure that's what we're gonna get. Because I'm just circling and not getting hit. Like, oh, hello, buddy. I've been covered in spit. Covered in frog goo. Get back attack. Oh, oh, he's go. Oh, he's going insane. We've evolved. We've we're at a stage two. Oh, look at that. It actually tells me I'm halfway dead, and it's hitting a little bit harder now. It's still not hitting very hard. Actually, I can see the damage I'm doing. Now. That's actually interesting. Is this because I killed enough of the Krogan or whatever, or the Foggin that? Uh, yeah. That's why I can see the health bar, because most of the bosses I haven't been able to see the health bar. But there's the summon leader Tidium down. Oh, that's the guy that was riding. This is a real this is a really long death animation. I guess that guy just straight up dies when his when his frog dies. Okay. Let's pop open the quest window. Alright, so quest completed to kill the summon leader, Tidium. So you're gonna go back to Caesar, the Glish commander. We got some gifts. Let's do that. Complete the gifts. Strike with. Oh, achieve combat level 30. Achievement unlocked. Oh, nice. We did get the level 30. Inventory expansion slot. So we got we got it going down on down here. We got four, up to four inventory expansions down there. Um. I also did open up my horse flute, uh, the permanent one, and I hot mapped it to right here. My horse is probably too. Oh no, my horse is not too far away. Well, all right then. Quest, do that, and here we go. I haven't been riding my horse too much in this, but I did get that out uh, since the last video. This is my level five horse, um, so I guess know that this is this is my good horse not quite sure what the second bar or the top bar is the health for the horse I'm not quite sure what the second bar is um, as you guys can see I've been putting out some tips and trick videos for this game um, let me know if there's anything in particular you want to see and I'll do my best to figure out how to do it and then explain it to you guys um, once again I'm still pretty pretty new to this but uh, as I figure stuff out or I get uh, you know as I pretty much as I figure stuff out and learn about the game um, putting in the effort to learn a lot about it so uh, might as well share what I've learned with you guys all right Caesar are you an adventurer very nice to meet you and now I got to return to Poivis um, so the trade weapon or the trade wagons or I guess prioritize protection for the trade wagons. Okay, sweet. So now I gotta go back to Poivis. Spooky place, right? 
You need to be even more I don't know why Poivus couldn't just do half of this by himself. Why he needed me. Alright, I got the job done, buddy. Can we go back to... Oh, now I gotta investigate the extraction mill occupied by the Nagas. So I actually have fought these enemies before. Um, I believe they're down... If you go, like, that way... You. Oh, let's see. If you go, like, that way. Go that way. Um... There's like a swamp that has them in it. I'm gonna leave my horse because I don't. I don't know. I don't want to take my horse into combat and then have my horse die when I'm off doing other stuff. What do we got here? Swamp. Oh yeah, these are the nagas. Yeah. And we got crabs. Yeah. Interesting. Hey. Let's see here kind of what experience we're looking at for each Naga kill. Alright, we're at 66.82. Okay, gives us about a little under 300 per yeah. kill, but I kill them really easily. Maybe slightly over level for this. I still wish the bosses were a little bit more difficult. Less to have hit harder, but there still haven't been a challenge. Hey. I don't know because of the boosted XP yeah. if I'm a little bit over leveled for areas and stuff, but I don't know. Stuff just yeah. feels a little bit too easy. Yeah. The crab kill. Right. Eh, the crab doesn't get as much as I thought. Okay, so we need to go. Okay, leave me alone for half a second. Where is it taking? map I'm facing the wrong direction but that's like where it was trying to take me that was weird but yeah there's like these swamp areas with them in it um which is i farmed them for a little bit i didn't farm them for a ton of time but i did farm them for about i don't know five minutes which isn't really farming at that point it's just kind of exploring but yeah i did fight these things before you can see because we can see the health bar i have a knowledge on the commander But I like these mass spawns. Like, when I can run through an area and queue up a bunch of guys following me, that's what I like. Run over here, queue up these guys. Yeah, we got a bunch of guys following us. Nice. Yeah, might as well quickly here farm these guys, get to level 31. Making that grind push. I've been grinding a lot more. I hadn't been grinding enemies, but I think it's I think it's something. Because yeah. we we want to get to level fifty. Yeah. Is it fifty six? I think fifty six is where you want to get to. Yeah. Doing some of the more interesting hey. crap. Yeah. Wait. So yeah, we'll get to level thirty one and then we'll go start the main quest. Ta all right, let's gather up. There's actually not that many enemies here. Let's run over here and try to gather up these dudes. Hello. Run in the circle. Grab their attention. There we go. So got the 85% off of those guys. Yeah. Go back and see. If they didn't respawn back here, I'm just gonna say I'm just gonna ignore it. But they did respawn. Beautiful. Sometimes the respawn timers can be a little janky. Let's grab these guys. Let's kite them into a circle here. Alright, boys, come and get it. They don't give as much experience. I was getting, there were some enemies that I was finding I was getting like 1% from, which seems a little 
crazy in retrospect. That's a lot. That's a lot. Like, that's 100 enemies gets you a level. And if you can kite them in like this, it's no time at all. But we're at 92%. We're getting there. But these guys are really easy for this being the after boss. Alright, let's go kite these guys, and this should get us to level uh, 31. Should, I say should, but I don't kite enough. Might have to kite again. I didn't get that many guys. Six percent. Um, let's kite around here. Grab these guys. Maybe eight percent. This should get us there. Ninety-nine. There we go. Level thirty-one. Okay, so let's go. So new skill has been learned. That was. Okay, so Black Wave level 3, Dark Armor level 6, learned all new, a bunch of new skills. Uh, let me look at my map. Where am I trying to go? Ah, here we go. Okay. Ancient Artifact. This looks different from the Ancient Artifact in the Stone Chamber. I guess everyone is really giving it their all. So investigate the extraction mill occupied by the Nagas. So we did that. So now we need to report to Isabel about the trade route. That seemed really odd. You just kind of come here, you interact with the artifact, and then you just leave. Ah, the spectra. Okay, so we got knowledge out of that. But you still don't quite know what knowledge is. You have to figure that out. an hour here i'm gonna eat some i'm gonna eat my breakfast and uh get to doing a little bit more research on what stuff is and whatnot but uh this video will be coming out so if i already know how to do stuff and i make a video on it and then you're sitting here and you're like um you made a video on it how do you how are you this stupid how'd you forget but uh I am pre-recording a lot of this stuff because obviously every boss I get to, I have to make a video um, because that's what I'm doing on this character. I'm kind of holding off on doing too much on the Triss character because I don't know... Where's my horse? Let me... Oops, wrong button. Like, probably too far away from my horse, yeah. Alright, guess we're running. Auto map. Just auto map it. Um, I'm waiting to do stuff on the Triss character because I'm not sure. I don't want to. I want to know what I'm doing a little bit more on that character since it's more of a, a walkthrough, do everything, um, tell you guys stuff. Uh, this is more of, you know, first playthrough, do my best to get through it. Okay. It's faster if I can just control this. I can cut through these fields back to where we need to get to. So that's why that's not an everyday series right now. It'll be every day once I figure my crap out and uh, and know exactly what I'm doing. But until then, you just get a daily episode of this because this will stop cease being daily episodes once I, you know, once I've killed all the bosses once. Then I have to figure out what I want to do with this character. <sighs> Alright, did I pick up anything I need to sell? Oh, we did get a uh, new earring, so let's go ahead and equip that. Eh, but other than that, not really. We'll sell that later. Yeah, we're good. Alright, I am back, Isabel. Now what do you Having need me trusted, to do? Heidel is not an easy you task. need me to turn your back against the chair and press the move back key for an extended period to eavesdrop on conversations nearby. Sam in the fountain. Jean Statue and Heidel Plaza. As well. Why can't they understand that? So wait, what does it want me to do? <laughs> Jean Merchant Gear Calvin. would bring great profit to Heidel as well. Turn your back against the Why chair and move the back key. Ah, 
Ah, there we go. Eavesdrop or peep. Not sure what I was supposed to get out of that, but... Alright. Part one complete. Now I need to go observe the fountain, so let's set that to auto track. Your head high for long. Ah, Jean Couching. Would bring Where is it? Where is it wanting me to go? I guess I need to go up and around. All right. Easy enough. We can take care of that. What are you on about? Is this? Yeah, this is the up and around. What I need to get into is crafting. That's what I'm gonna. That's kind of the first thing I'm gonna get way into. All right, the fountain statue of Heidel Plaza. Read the words engraved in memory of the heroes who saved Heidel from the tyranny of the former lord. The fountain statue of Heidel. Oh, we already. Okay, okay, we're good. Okay, that's not what it wanted. Uh, a memorial stone commemorating legendary war heroes of Serendia history. The names of several officers, including Cliff, are engraved on the stone. The stone statue was created to commemorate Serendia's greatest achievements. Oddly, the statue was made by a sculptor from the east. The mysterious sculptor Oyen, who travels the world leaving marvelous statues or sculptures behind, took three years to complete it, the longest period of time he's ever stayed anywhere. Would you like to join me for the ball that's oh. going to be held soon? Fountain statue. Here we go. The fountain. Uh, no, did I already? Yeah, I already looked at that. So did I not look at the f actual fountain? Okay, you can see the symbolic statue of Heidel. Take a closer look at the statue to comfort ourselves. Oh, hold on. This is what it wants me to do. Okay. What am I supposed to be? Okay, I don't know what I was supposed to see there, but you, you know, we we got her done. We got her done. Uh, we got a couple of black spirit gifts here. So let's collect those. Accept that. Complete that and complete that. Okay, so I'm assuming we have to go back to Isabel. Yeah, that's what it looks like. All right, so back to the inventory. S expansion slot, expansion slot. What are we looking at now? Nice, we almost got a full row below that row. A row, be a low, a row below a row. <clears throat> All right. Back to turn back to turn in our quest. Bring great ah, profit to hide as well. Why can't they understand that? We're prepared to leave. We must go to the North Wheat Plantation. So Okay, complete that. Now our mission Jordy, is to tell Poivis. Okay. There must be something he's hiding. Alright, Poivis, we're all we're all good to go. What are you waiting for? Are you with Bobby So Lauren? meet the spearheading captain at the northern neutral zone. My axe has no pain. Why does your character do this sometimes? They're, they just like, look at him. I'm Sonic, like. <laughs> why am I running so fast? Yo, this is kind of crazy. This is like horse speed that we're running at here. We are booking it. But I'm sad. I might have to start a third character. Um, to play with my friends because they're way behind and they're not gonna play it as much as me So I can't use this character because I'm way too far ahead I can't use the, the plus or the walkthrough character because well to walk through I got to record everything and I can't so it leaves me to either make a third character which will be a ranger or Just not play with them really which that's tragic. So probably going to have to make a third character and simply use it for playing with them. 
But the, the sad thing is, is then I gotta catch it up because they're already at the second boss. They played yesterday without me. Well, I was I guess, I guess I was there, but I wasn't doing anything. I was off. I was off doing my own thing with my character. But they got to the second boss, which is kind of tragic because now I gotta catch up to the second boss. But that's just, that's just how things go. But I would have no problem having three characters. I mean, I'm going to have characters on characters on characters if, I, if I'm definitely going to stay with this game. Which, which, which I'm pretty sure I am. I, I really like this game. I like the grinding in this game. And I want to get into the more detailed stuff with this game. So I'm interested to see how it goes. Who am I supposed to talk to here? I guess, here we go. Lead captain. Okay, so we met him. What are we supposed to do now? We need to defeat bandit warriors, giant bandits, demi-beast bandit warriors. Alright, these sound like some actual heavy hitter, heavy hitting contenders. Let's see here, giant drill sergeant. So learn about bandits. I can do that. This is a level 31 quest. Where's that other quest I saw? Ah, to you. Got a quest for me? Kill bandit defense captain. Okay, we can do that. We can kill three of those for you. Okay, so let's set active quest as that. And let's go kill some bandits. We got maybe another quest down here. Hey buddy, what can I do for you? Collect giant bandits bear hide hoods? Guess I can do that as well. We're, we're on the bandit killing... Oh my gosh, there's another dude. What quest do we got from you, buddy? Hello, villager. Destroy bandit huts with an important item with Heidel's mark on it. Got another quest as well. Atrocious bandits. Kill bandits. Alright, we'll just grab all of these quests at the same time. We'll get to work. Hello, bandits. What are we looking at for... Oh, you guys are special. What? Get smoked. Yeah! All right, you're all good to go, my dude. Get on your horse. Get out of here. So we need giant bandits and demi-beast bandits. That's kind of... I'm going to assume that's a giant yeah. bandit there. Yeah. Hey. What is a demi-beast bandit? That's... Uh, uh, are you a demi-beast? No, you're a raid captain. Yeah. Okay. Bro, this dude... Didn't hit me for any damage. He just, oh my gosh. Okay. There's a Demi Beast bandit right here. And he's dead. They actually hit for a little bit of power. Hello, giant bandit. I need to get you up out of here. You as well. Get out of here. Here's a Demi Beast bandit. Interesting. So it's the deer people. Demi Beast. This means the deer people. Got a bandit's dagger. No, don't, don't smash me. It's not time to slam. Alright, I already got A on Demi Beast Warriors. Nice. Ooh, I freed a guy. Nice. Destroyed a tent. Look at that. We completed three quests already. Yeah. It's actually nice that I hey. actually interact. I, I figured that out, which is nice. I now know that uh, hey. if you yeah. if you see like that blue above hey. their head or whatever, hey. it means that they have a quest that you can accept. Can't open any of these chests. Probably need a lockpick skill high enough. That's what I'm assuming. Hey. Can't destroy that tent. Alright, so we need three more giant, or five Wait. more giant bandits. And we need five more just regular bandits. I guess I should probably not run by you. I was gonna try to kite them together, but I shouldn't probably try to kite enemies I need to kill in case. In case there are other people here, I don't want my kills getting stolen. I don't want to get yoinked. Sometimes my, sometimes my free camming is trash. Oh my gosh. Oh. 
What did I get hit by? What arrow? Who is hitting me with that arrow that did so much damage? Freaking destroyed. We're about to hit level 32. That's beautiful. Eh, let's go up here. See what we can find up here. We need three more... Two more giant bandits after I wreck this guy. Wait. Two more giant bandits to go. I see one more here. I see two more. Alright, everybody. Come on. Come on. Kite it up. Kite it up. Let me get it. I like how my penguin slides on the ground and creates, like, ice to get up. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Get out of there. Get out of there. Holy crap. Not what I was expecting at all. What hit me so hard? Holy crap. What hit me so hard? It couldn't have just been a basic man. There's no way. That, that can't be real. I did not just get that hit that hard by a basic band. That's level 32. My giant bandit friend here is oblivious. Absolute Darkness 3. Sinister Shadow 3. Dark Maneuver 6. There we go. Alright, now we gotta go... Oh no, we need to kill three bandit defense captains. So I need to kill two more bandit defense captains. Hold on. Let's see if we can find two more bandit defense captains so that I can complete that quest. Oh look, two bandit defense captains. Oh look, three bandit defense captains. Hey guys, can you kite? Come here, come here. I need to kill you all at once. I need to get that multi hit so I can fight easier. And there's all four quests completed. Yeah. And we got a dude stuck in the air. Yeah. Get out, my dudes. Rescue, he is here. Yeah. Okay. Bandit treasure yeah. chest. Oh. Huh. Okay, I said to beat. I said to beat it. Stop it! Get out of here. Stealing treasure. Yeah. Yeah, give me all that bandit loot. Yeah. This is an interesting way to have loot. Destroyable yeah. chest. Yeah. Alright, I think we're good. Let's head on back out of here. Is there anybody who needed saving? Any more chests? I don't think I see anybody. What is that? Oper operation plans. Hello. Oh my gosh, so many dudes. Alright, alright, I'll kill you guys. Get off. There we go. Already 25% through the next level. I'm gonna get going. I'm gonna head back at least here. I think I can turn two. It looks like I can turn two of the quests in maybe to the Black Spirit. But I need to get some room away from these dudes. Alright, bro. You wanna die that bad? You die. Okay. Quests. Okay, so this is the one. I need to complete, but looks like I complete it with you. Except seize the orders. Oh, I complete it all. Holy crap. Alright, let's go back so that I can... Let's go back so I can turn in these quests and maybe see if they have a second. Any of them have another quest potentially that I could do. Otherwise, we'll call it an episode and we'll I'll come back to this. I want to turn all these quests in in case that there are potentially more quests. Because then I can... Why do I have the chat on? That's how you turn the chat off if you didn't know. Toggle the chat like that. 
and the mapping on this game is uh, it, it's something when that happens like that just walked me into a freaking where is this this is the weirdest route ever where on earth is this taking me all right well it got me to where i needed to go turn in all of these quests so we're at 32 58 percent complete that one and complete this one let's take let's take the medium potion it's kind of odd that that guy had two quests that you could complete together it's good though take more take medium potions we can complete these as well it's just all about the medium potions. Oops. Uh, I got myself stuck. Complete this. Take more medium potions. Alright, we got more stuff up here. Hello, buddy. Let me take your quest. I guess I could have been doing this quest. And let me take your quest. More, more bandits. Kind of crazy. Ton, tons of bandit quests, but uh, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. Drop it a big ol' like if you did. Subscribe if you have not. And uh, I will catch you guys in the next episode of Black Desert on the Xbox One. Peace.